it looks like Apple is uh, dropping some mass requirements in their Apple retail stores, not everywhere, but it looks like just in a several states to start with. Red course, states looking like. Yeah, uh, <laughs> Ohio, Kansas, Kentucky, North Carolina, and of course, Georgia, where we're at. Uh, you could make a correlation. Uh, those are states where, um, depending on where you lean political, you're probably against masks. Um, those are probably states that have already, I, I can only speak for Georgia, but I'm assuming that's the same for some of these other places that didn't have strict mask requirements to start with. So mm -hmm. it's probably a little bit easier for Apple to go ahead and drop their mask restrictions when the state itself really wasn't mm -hmm. feeling masks all that much. Um, yeah, and if you read down further in the article that talks about states that still have mask requirements, they're still keeping those requirements for the states that still have it. So Right, right, right. And uh, employees at Apple stores, regardless of where they are, will be required to wear a mask regardless of vaccination status. So whether you're mm -hmm. vaccinated or not, you, as an employee of Apple, you still have to wear a mask, which is kind of dumb, if you ask me, especially if I'm an Apple employee. Yeah, I'm wearing my mask, but the mask works two ways. Not You're only making... does it stop me from getting COVID, it stops me from me? spreading COVID. Yep. So if I just have a mask on that's stopping me from spreading COVID, the customers walking in and out of the store 50 million times, all thousands of however many people. Touching things around and everybody. And breathing on me, you know, that's uh, more susceptible to Apple employees catching COVID because people walking in without masks want to be all in your face running their mouth, right? So. Right. Um, I think that I think Apple's probably doing it more for the customer, right. um, particularly with some of the states that we mentioned. It's probably more of a PR type thing. But one thing people should remember, even if the mask mandates come down, you can still wear your mask. I mean, I'm in Georgia. People have been stopped wearing masks a long time. I still put mine on. You can still wear them. But again, uh, yes, it's one of those things. But, but it's still, again, like you said, it is a two-way street uh -huh. and it, you know, protects, you know, people both ways. So it's ideal for everybody to have to wear a mask. But even if you don't have a mask mandate, you can still wear it. Man, listen, people, <laughs> <laughs> as, I know, soon, I know. as soon as the mask mandates ease, people are going to burn their masks <laughs> because it is a hassle. I will admit. Wearing a mask, remembering to bring my mask. There's plenty of times where I couldn't find parking in the parking lot. So I parked all the way in the back, got all the way to the door, and then I had Real a life, life decision. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> this is a life, death, dead or alive, life-changing decision. Do I go into the store or do I go all the way back to my car to get the mask Get that them I forgot, steps right? in. <laughs> it is a hassle. But, yeah, you know, it is definitely, you know, so I can see people again, going back to our original point, these uh, states that we mentioned, that would be one of the first uh, Apple is going to drop these mass requirements for are states to where the majority of people lean to the side of mass requirements are dumb. So mm -hmm. as soon as they get the green light, that's uh, retail, consumer, private businesses, are easing their mask requirements as well, they're not wearing masks ever at all. And then that's going to eventually uh, bleed into some of the other people that were like, well, I'm still gonna wear a mask. They're gonna look around and see nobody wearing masks. It's like, okay, well, I'm not gonna be the only one out here trying if nobody else is trying, it seems pointless. So I can even right. see some of those people kind of easing on their own mask restrictions you know, mm -hmm. and it's getting to be summertime, more people are going to be want to be out and about or springtime rather bleeding into the summer. So it, it's to me, it's kind of not sad, disappointing mm -hmm. that the country as a whole is almost like, you know, we're just over COVID and I am too. But at the same time, it's like, I, I want to be the type of person that looks out for other people. Right. Um, in addition, as just well as myself. myself, right? Yeah. yeah, but again, we know the country that we live in, um, and someone did like a side by side, and we're basically at the same place we were 
February of 2021 with COVID cases and deaths. So it's one of those things where when they first started, you know, saying, you know, if you, you know, get the vaccine, then, you know, people just like, oh, I have to wear the mask anymore. And it's just one of those things where I just, I don't know. And where... let's just say, and then let's just say for argument's sake, the masks really don't do anything. To me, it just shows good faith yeah. that I am concerned that I may I care you about you. Yeah. And right, right. It, we're all in this. It, the mask thing is almost like symbolism to me. It's like the flag. It's like we're in this together. Let's let's get together. Let's work this thing out. And then once the numbers come down, once everybody's either vaccinated or herd immunity, the last kind of like signif signifier that we've done it is everybody gets to take their masks off. That's like the last, you know, we've done everything else. We've done everything we can possibly do. The numbers are down. Um, uh, uh, you know, pe more people are getting um, immunized mm -hmm. or herd immunity. There's less people just getting it. It's like, all right, now we can celebrate. Let's take off the mask. But it seems yeah. like that's the first thing people want to do. And it's take like, off the mask. <laughs> and, yeah. and other countries have proven that you can get to that point. Multiple mm -hmm. countries have proven that, but they were the ones who were willing to make the sacrifice on the front end. Uh, so, you know, uh, here we oh, are. Uh, but here we'll yeah, be. it is what it is. Uh, you know, yep. so uh, do what's best for you, I suppose. Yep. <laughs>